Hi guys, today we're gonna explain about fiber splicing process. Fiber splicing is the process of permanently joining two fiber together. There are two types of fiber splicing, which is fusion and mechanical. Before we go on on the splicing process, let me explain to you about the safety precautions. Firstly, use the alcohol with precautions. Second, handle the fiber cable safely because it has tiny glasses which can be harmful for our body. Third, remember the specification of splice loss must be below than 0.05 dB. Lastly, do not bring any foods and beverages into working area. Now I will explain to you about all the tools and apparatus that we will use in this process. Let's take a look. The first one is the fusion splicing machine. This is the main thing that we will use in this process. You are advised to use this DIY while being monitored by your lecturer or expertise. Next is the cleaver. You will use this to cleave the fiber with high precision. Yes, we do need alcohol to clean thoroughly the fiber cables. We may need a few fiber stripper because each of it has a different position of diameter. Don't forget the tissue to wipe the fiber cables with alcohol. Last but not least, we need to have the protection sleeve and the fiber cables. The first step is strip down the outer jacket of the fiber cable. You need to do this carefully to avoid damaging the fiber cable. As you can see, if you done it correctly, you will see the aramic yarn and cladding clearly. Next, insert the protection sleeve by sliding it through the fiber cables. After that, strip down the fiber cables until you will see the core of the cables. Remember to use correct diameter and what type of fiber stripper they will use in this process. Kindly ask your lecturer for help if you are not sure. This is the most critical phase of splicing where fiber damage is most likely to take place here. Please do it gently to avoid damaging the cable. Next, cover your tissue with alcohol and gently clean thoroughly the fiber cable. Remember to use the alcohol carefully because it is harmful for our body. Push the button and lay down the fiber cable into the fiber holder. Do ensure that you are placing the fiber cable into the correct measure. After you are satisfied with your placing, close the cleaver and cleave the cable. Make sure you have applied all of the steps mentioned before into another cable that will be connected with this cable. Put the fiber cables into the fiber holder in fusion splicing machine. Please ensure that you have placed the tip of the fiber cable close to the lead. Once you have done it, close the head of the fusion splicing machine and press the set button. As you can see, now the fiber cable are undergo the fusion splicing process. Open the heater clamps from both sides and put the fiber cables. Once you have placed it nicely, close the clamp and start the heating process by press the heat button. Please wait while the cable is undergoing the heating process as the light indicator will turn yellow to red. Ta -da! As you can see right now, the cable is successfully joined by using fusion splicing process. It is not that hard, isn't it? So this is how the splicing process using fusion splicing method. I hope you guys gain more knowledge on this topic. Thank you for watching. Bye.